again today with another boy group mix. I'm back with another boy group mix. I'm going to be reacting to some boy groupy things that have dropped this week and no not last week. Everything has actually dropped this week. Interesting. So I'm going to be doing um, next Z. It's next Z. Uh, it says it in there in Hangul. So it's next Z. Next Z. So I'm assuming it's next Z, next Z, I don't know, apologies for the quality of this video, it's about to rain, so it's gone really dark, and when that happens, because I film in daylight, like I don't like um, lights and stuff like that, I just like it to be natural, I think it's, I don't know, um, so yeah, if the quality of this video goes bad, I apologise, it's fine, you don't want to see me in like 4k, anyway, next Z, Nalina, Wave this high five. Is high five a pre-release? I think it might be a pre-release. I probably should have waited just to do like the pre-release and the title track together, but I didn't, so whatever. Um, <laughs> Ace's pin... Is that meant to be pinata? I'm not sure because it doesn't have the little squiggly thing on top, and I think pinata spelt with the little thingy on top. What's it called? Oh, I know what it's called, but I've forgotten. And then of course, J Tang's La Cell Avenue. I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah, I love me some J Tang. You know how much I love J Tang. And yeah, super excited. Let's just go. Disclaimer I don't like to react with captions on as I find them distracting. I like to concentrate on the music, and the music production is what I like to comment on the most. When I'm looking at the words at the bottom of the screen, I'm missing parts of the song, their vocals, and I'm missing parts of the MV and choreo. I'll read the lyrics later in my own time. Okay, guys, let's go. So I'm going to watch all four of these in one go, and then I'll talk about them. Sorry, hiccups and burps. And then I'll talk about them all. Who's messaging me? And then I'll talk about them all afterwards. We're starting off with Nexi's Nali Nap. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Feel things. Can you imagine if I just like projectile vomit <laughs> on camera? Let's go. <laughs> uh, give me a minute, I'm gonna vomit. Uh, Love the echoey repeats. Burnu, burnu. Wah, wah, wah. His tone? Uh. Everybody watch out. Everybody watch out. Yeah. Yeah. 
Have you noticed? Like, well, I'll turn that up. I love this the who jumper. Oh wow! Why would they trash this man? Why did they trash boss man the shop? That slapped. Songs are becoming like smoother. What we talk, I'd say. Becoming like the mature group, the mature unit, the mature NCT unit, don't you think? So, is the six mini album out already? Or is that pre release? You know what? Let me check really quick. I need to check really, really quick, guys. I'm so sorry. Just give me one sec. If it is out, I'll do an album first listen next week. I didn't realize. I thought this was a pre release, truly. Let me see. No, it's just a single. So is it just a single? Oh, I guess it is a pre release. I'm assuming this is Pinata, but they didn't spell it with the Nya. <coughs> yeah. 
of that that I liked and elements that I didn't like. I feel like the mixing was a bit off in parts, like everything was loud at the same vo in at the same volume. Does that make sense? I'll talk about more after. Oh Jade! I love this boy! I love this boy!
why music like Sunday morning. The people, them. Yeah, it's for the people, them. Hmm. Yeah, you agree. He agrees. It's for the people, then. It's more. Talk to me, baby, right now. Tell me what you need. Ah, I love Jay Chang. <laughs> I swear to God. Let me tell you something, yeah? I wanted him to win the whole show. What was the show called? Boys Planet. I wanted him to win the whole show. I know it's a group thing, but I just wanted him to win alone, solo. Just, just him. I don't care. That's how I felt. That's how much I loved him. And the fact he didn't make it to the final group, I'm glad. Because as much as I love what they're called, I love them. I, I love them and I've forgotten what they're called. My ADHD is so bad. You know, the other day I forgot XO, what XO were called. One of my all time favorite groups. I was like, what are they called? Um, what are they called? Ah! I'm really literally gonna Google it. How do I find out? I just literally typed Google into Google. Should I go on meds? Maybe this is a sign. Right, how do I find out? Boys, planet, Winners. If I put that, then it's gonna come up, right? Boys Planet's winners. Why is it giving me Girls Planet? Why isn't it saying? Why isn't it saying? Right, let me put a Boys Planet group. Guys, what the hell is happening? Group. Group. Boys Planet group. It's still not coming up. What the hell is going on? Oh, what are they called? What are they called? What are they called? <laughs> Guys. Uh, what, is, what the hell is happening? I'm not even going to edit this out. You're going to have to sit here and shout. I bet you, you are literally shouting at the screen right now. Okay, let me type in Boys Planet group. And I just did that. Zero face one! <laughs> Oh my fucking God, Jesus Christ. My brain is fried. ADHD has fried my brain. As much as I love Zero Base One, I'm sorry, Jay Tang is too big for that group. And then, oh, I forgot the name of the other group now, the other group you joined. What's the other group? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I think he works in that as well. Don't get it twisted, but I prefer him as a solo artist, personally. I think his voice is too good and he's too big. His light shines too bright for a group. That's just me. Absolutely fantastic song, fantastic voice. I love you, Jay Chan. Ace, I feel like I've always said that I prefer Ace's softer side and I didn't react to them for the longest time and I, there's lots of stuff, stuff of theirs that I didn't react to 
for the longest time because their sound just wasn't for me. Like their sound from debut. I used to watch their relay dance thing because I think they're fantastic dancers. However, their songs just were just never music that I'd put on and listen to. Um, very loud in your face, which I like sometimes, but yeah, um, it just wasn't really for me. But then sometimes they'd release softer stuff and I'd like it and I'd vibe with it. Um, but this sort of sound for me from them isn't my vibe. I'd say that there were definitely elements in the song that I liked. I love the choreo, by the way, and I love like the whole performancey aspect of it. However, I feel like, I don't know if it's just me, the mixing felt bad in parts of the chorus. It felt like everything was at like full volume. And like, it was just like noise. Like, do you ever like, if you, are you ever like listening to music on Spotify and then you accidentally play a video and it, Spotify doesn't stop. And then you've just got two things on top of each other. That's what it kind of felt like. I don't know if that, that was intentional. I don't know if it's just me, but it felt a bit messy at times. Um, I didn't hate it though. And there were elements that I did like. I just feel like the mixing was a bit off for me. Um, Wavy's high five, 10 out of 10. It was a banger. It was a bop, the melodies. Wavy are coming with a very specific a specific, a specific, what did I say? Specific, spe a specific vibe these days. I feel like they're going for something a little bit more mature. A little, I described it as smooth. Um, I feel like they're becoming like almost the more mature adult unit for NCT, and I'm here for it and I vibe with it. I definitely feel like with everything that's happened, there needed to be a shift, a change um, to like give them an identity for who they are now. And I feel like this vibe, this identity really, really works for me. The song was brilliant. Loved. Uh, Nexinalina was 10 out of 10. I loved it. Banger, bop. I love the subtle shifts within the song. I wouldn't say they were like, See, I love this when songs like that's just so well produced, like switch ups, but it was like subtle shifts, if that makes sense. Um, and I really, really like that. Again, Melody's fantastic and they're super, 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 super talented. Great vocalists, great rappers, great dancers. Uh, the MV was fun as well. I also wanted to say when I was watching, have you noticed like almost every group now has like non Korean people in the MV, like Western people? in their MVs. Have you noticed that? Like before, you'd never really have anyone. It would only ever be like the group. And then you started getting backup dancers more and then maybe Korean people here and there. Now it's just like pure Western people. Um, I'm not mad at it. It's just an observation that I've noticed. Like everyone's doing that these days. I don't know, maybe it's because they're going abroad to do their MVs now or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know which group you're here for. Let me know if you discovered something new. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. <clears throat> if you have subscribed, I love you. I love you. Go and follow me on Instagram, guys. Go and follow me on Twitter and TikTok. Goodbye.